all right youtube is this your boy the virus system and we are here to do the chiri chiri chara chara again right here on this channel today i will be guiding you through how to set up this multi vendor gross cd android app with back end that is what we'll be doing today and then look at the price 99 dollars wow um let's see um the latest version which is um 1.4 was released out on the 5th of um february 20 um 20 and that is what we'll be learning how to set up right here so i have it already set up in my c panel here and then i can log into to see how it is right here and then boom we are all set to go with so um let me um give you a test login so let's see before we dive into setting up a new one in our c panel too as well so today we're learning how to do it in what c panel we'll be creating a subdomain at fresh we learn how to at upload um the script into our subdomain and from there we go on with what the installation so i'll look for um, the default user logins that comes to the application so i have um the multi vendor which is the main admin itself the super admin background so we copy that and then come to my admin panel then we paste it there then password then we copy that to as well oh my god so we copy that as well then we log in as well so let's try to see how the admin panel looks for version 1.4 and then we proceed to how to install what this particular version to as well so i have the script here with me right here this is the script so i have version 1.3 which is the previous one and then this is version 1.4 which is the latest one which is the 5th february 2020 release to as well so let's see how the admin panel is this is the admin panel to as well so we go three cities you add cities subdomain stores and then banners and so forth and so on and then this is how the whole script run and after setting up the back end we'll be learning how to build each android app that comes with this particular application so let's dive into my c panel right here and on my c panel we are going to learn how to create a subdomain and then upload our script onto this subdomain and then boom we are done with it so i'm going to create a subdomain so i'll go down to subdomains so under domains i'll hit on subdomain and then i'm going to give it a name gross city one because already have a subdomain they call what gross city which i installed the initial one on it so this time around we are going to pick what gross city one so gross city gross city one so that is my new subdomain then we click on the create button to create what that subdomain and then after creating that subdomain we need to create a database where our database installation of um, data will go into so we go back to um our main menu of cpanel then we look for databases and then we create out a database so i will hit on my sql database my sql database chiri chiri then i'll give it a name so i'll give it the same name gross city one so we are done then i hit on the create button so we are creating our database chiri chiri chara chara and our database is done creating now we have to assign a username and password for this particular database to be able to access the database so what we need to do is that we need to go down to our users and then we have the add user to database so i'm going to select um the virus s underscore avenash that is a username i want to assign to the database used for my installation and then my database is called gross city i've selected the username and the database and then i'll hit on add and that is going to add privileges to um the database so that we can access what the database so i'll hit on all privileges and then i'll come to what make changes and when i make changes boom then the changes has affected what my database so now if we are going to access this particular database then we are going to use this username and it password to be able to access this particular database so now what we need to do is that we need to upload our script into our subdomain so in load in loading that we come back to the main menu then we hit on file manager then when file manager opens then we look for the subdomain that we have created and the subdomain we have created is what gross cd1 so i'll hit on gross cd1 and then we hit on the upload button here now when you click on the upload button it opens a new window and then it's asking you to select the file that you want to upload into the subdomain is that okay so when i click a dialog box comes up then i select the particular file that i want and after that it will start uploading but i uploaded the script earlier on onto what my c panel on the first gross cd what subdomain that i created so i'll just copy it from there to my next subdomain and then this will help us to learn how to copy 
from one subdomain to another subdomain so what we need to do is that we need to go to um the gross city subdomain i created earlier on and copy an um, initial upload that i made onto this subdomain to the new one so i'll look for it i have back end code here i'll click on it then i'll come to copy then if i hit on copy then it asks which particular subdomain am i going to copy to so i'm copying to what gross city one so i'll hit on i'll add one to my gross city and then i'll click on copy now it has made a copy to my sub um gross city domain one so when i go to gross city domain one then i have the back end file here so now i'm going to extract that file to begin with at my installation so i right click and then extract file then I'm extracting the file chiri chiri chara chara chiri chiri chara chara. Let's give it some few seconds. All right, so the script is done extracting in my C panel. So I'll close this extraction dialog box. And then we proceed to what? The installation of the script. So I'll open a new tab here. I have um, already opened the virus system. So because of typing um, laziness, I'll just add gross CD1 to the virus system domain already opened. One dot then enter now when i start my enter buttons give me error so i have to do installation so i'll hit on this and then i'll type install then to start installing the script because there's a folder in it called install so i'm accessing the installation folder so and then our installation has begun so here our sql is perfect and then my sql and everything extension is okay so i'll hit next to go to the next button and at this point we are supposed to provide our license key to be able to install this particular script so i'm going to enter my license key which i have here then i will enter my name then i'm done then i'll click on the verified button and then everything is ready for installation then we proceed now here we are supposed to enter our database details and then our database details we created earlier on the host is local host then the database username is the virus the virus s underscore avanash and then password and then we have um, the database name which is the virus s underscore gross cd one so that is it so i'll hit on the import button to import the database into um our database that is if all credentials are correct that i've provided into the dialog box and everything is okay voila then we are done so we hit on the next button and then our installation is complete successfully so to access our admin panel what we need to do is that we need to clear off the installation and it other alliance and then hit on the enter key and then boom our login button is displayed and then we are ready to access our login button for gross city multi vendor android app with back end so let's give you some few seconds to load yeah so you can see that our script is ready and we are ready to go so youtubers this is your boy the virus system and we are doing the chiri chiri chara chara so stay tuned with my channel and subscribe to my channel and hit the bell button and please do visit my blog the virus systems and then get some free stuff to test at your fingertips before you head towards the code can you to buy them for commercial use please never use editing on my blog for commercial purpose because developers has the right to their property so stay tuned with the virus system and always always support the virus system and please one thing i always recommend is that keep on watching this video until you understand it before you move on to something else don't just watch it once and assume that you have understood it and then when you are trying the installation and it is not working then you keep on leaving comments the virus system this is not working this is not working i import this is not working i'm pure distance working please 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 watch it a couple of times and when you are satisfied then you go on to installing it stay tuned